All right, well, as we head on into the evening, we are expecting conditions to be more on the cooler side for us. Well, we do see a clear skies across the region, which will be great because we'll have another slight chance of seeing the northern lights. Well, a happy Friday evening, everyone. Chief Meteorologist Adam Claybon here with your website weather update. Yes, a slight chance of seeing the northern lights, but it will be a bit on the cool side. Temperatures today have been below those averages at 68 in Harrisville, 71 currently in Alpena, and seeing more of those lower 70s showing up in Atlanta and in Mayo. Now, as we take a look at what we'll be expecting over the next 24 hours, uh, not really much of anything because high pressure is in control and that's going to keep us uh, pretty much clear. Maybe a few areas of fog early tomorrow morning, but we do see more of that sun as we go on into the day tomorrow. A few passing clouds late tomorrow night and then on into Sunday, maybe expecting a few clouds to be in place also. Now on into Labor Day, clouds pass in and pass out, but we should remain fairly sunny and also expecting high temperatures to flirt with that 80 degree mark as we'll watch out for this system just off to our west, but not expect any rain from it. It looks to be mostly off to Minnesota and in northern Wisconsin. This evening, our numbers will dip down into the middle 40s for overnight lows, so a bit on the cool side. More of that late summer chill in the air. Winds should be very calm into the day tomorrow. Saturday, highs in the middle 70s, so warming up nicely. And then tomorrow, yet again, expecting those numbers to dip down into the upper 40s. Now, your seven day forecast highs will reach the middle 70s by Sunday, but closer to 80 heading on into Labor Day itself with a mix of sun and clouds. Tuesday, the first day of school, will top off at 82 and notice more of those middle to upper 70s as we go later on into next week.